morning crafty peeps I'm so excited to share with you another project share and this is using the KS craft Christmas tree planner page die set and I purchased this from Amazon so um, let me let you know what the measurements of this is first of all it is eight and a half by um, almost let's see five and five eighths okay so if you have a standard size um die cutting machine um any of the designs that nicole does for chaos crafts will fit in there so i just wanted to let you know that um so first of all this is the base page and i love how it already has the holes um ready to go so i can just slide it right into my planner and i don't have to mess with it then you have your layering page that you can use your pattern paper with and then also you have your little garland strands i love that okay and I love how she has like where you can just do it all at one time. So I don't have to keep running it through my dye machine. And then also she has this really super cute doily um, garland too. And um, I especially love that because I love Shabby Chic and it reminds me of that. And then also she has this string lights. And this is actually all on one piece for the base. And then if you want to have different colored bulbs, she gives you eight of these. So it's, you know, I just kind of kept them together on what, well, actually they are together on one thing. I <laughs> don't let me lie. <laughs> okay, so anyway, um, you just run it through. So I ran it through maybe four times with four different colors, maybe five times, I don't know. Um, but anyway, that's, that's it. So it's super easy to do. And let me show you how it turned out. So this is my planner that I purchased from Amazon. I actually got two in a pack and I think it was like maybe $12. So I thought that was a really great deal. And I believe this is the A5 if I remember correctly. So anyway, um, and her planner pages fit perfectly in here. This is the countdown to Christmas one that I've done before. And then here is the little Christmas tree planner page. Is that not stinking cute? I really love how it turned out. So the paper collection that I used for the base page is the Michaels 110 pound cardstock. And I also use that for the um, Christmas light strand. Okay. Then for the pattern paper, I use the Michaels recollection sugar plum set and I really love that one because it um, had the pastel colors and also it reminded me of the shabby chic which this came in very handy the little doily um, then also um, the Christmas bulbs that I had cut out using the sugar plum paper I went ahead and went on top of it with my um, Nouveau drops and the Merry Christmas I actually created in Adobe and then I cut it out on my Cricut and then um, the little pearls that I used or flat back pearls are from Renee Bouquet's candy cotton candy and then also I used some of the um, goodies that Debbie sent me I love these little iridescent or what I call hollow you know they kind of have that holographic effect um so i thought they were really pretty and i thought they turned out really 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 super cute so anyway um and then here's the little pink page isn't that sweet so anyway guys i hope you all love what i created i do have a quick process video of what i did um don't forget to visit the ks craft amazon store and also her aliexpress store so anyway i hope you all have a wonderful and fabulous day guys and don't forget i'll have all the links down below have a great one guys bye